John, it's this point day at Tameside Stadium. Uh, what do you think went wrong? Um, well, it was it was it was a it was a poor performance. I would say in the main, it was a bit flat. Um, can't put my finger on why. I've, you know, I've talked to the players, and um, you know, they they all seem a bit. It's all quite quiet in there, as if there was. I don't know the shortage of energy. I don't know whether whether we've had a tough week training or or you know they just the energy levels didn't quite seem there today. We didn't move the ball quickly enough. Um, there was parts of the pitch where we weren't doing what we we always set out to do, and and people you have to keep drumming and driving home the message about you know doing certain things in certain situations or else the the opposition will just sit back and let you have it and and wait for you to make a mistake and pick it off and and we we didn't do a number of things centre half didn't bring the ball out like they they, they are expected to. You know, and uh, that was one of the, the issues. I don't think we moved the ball quick enough. Um, you know, we we talk regularly about moving the ball, playing quickly, and um, but you know, it's, it's two two disappointing goals for me. I think first one the set piece, the lad obviously Josh Wilson scored and uh, he's got away from from Jono. Jono's got blocked. They good set piece back from them. Good delivery, right area. Good finish, but John always got himself in a situation where he's allowed himself to get block, blocked. Uh, and the second one, whereas which there was a bit, a bit of a farce with the, the the red card that wasn't a red card. Um, the referee came over. The game had stopped for two, three minutes. While well, he sorts of faults the issue out, and then they take a quick free kick, and he's not, he's not blowing the whistle. We're not ready. He's not blowing the whistle. He lets them play a quick one, and Nick Orton gets inside. His man and smashes it. So, you know, outside of that, they haven't created much much themselves. So, so disappointing. Yeah, disappointing. I think the best team won on the day. Probably they uh, they looked, you know, they looked pretty solid like they normally do. On a positive note, it's great to see Sam Walker back at Curzon. Yeah, uh, you must please see him back. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I mean, Sam's obviously got to to pick up the. Um, just sort of pick up the tempo of how and, and, and then sort of how, remind himself how we, we go about things in probably slightly different encounter. Um, but I think it's just it's just him finding his feet, getting a bit of match match fitness. He's done well there. He's got 90 minutes in. It's first he's probably done for a while, and I thought he kept going really well. And uh, as you can see, his quality and his set pieces put some good areas for us, and we, we might have got some in the first half. But uh, yeah, I'm delighted to see him here. I know he'll be hurting in there for sure. I can tell by his face. I look at him and he's he always hurts when he gets beat. And he's playing for, you know, chip shot league on, on a Sunday. You know, when years gone by, it hurts him. So that's what you want. We've obviously brought Sam in. Um, would you be looking to bring any more players in? Yeah, forward? absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm actively looking. We've got to. Um, we've got to. I can't be, be seen on seen on here what what and who, but. You know, we've got to um, maybe freshen one or two areas up because we want to be exciting. We don't want to be boring. I've just said that to lads. I'm not prepared to sit and watch boring football. We want it to be good quality and want it to be quick. And if the lads who we've got can't can't provide that, then I'm going to have to change and a few of them around to remind them what's required. So, you know. We're looking constantly, and we've got a few irons in the fire, and uh, we'll see shortly whether we can we can uh, get them in. We're back here next week. Uh, we host Kidderminster. Yep. What do you think we need to do differently to get something out of that game? Well, it's difficult. You know, Kidderminster a good side, but they do give you a bit of a chance. They will come and try and play. We're going to have to be very disciplined. We're going to have to defend well. Um, and again, like we see, we with our most of our games now, there's not loads of chances. There's been very few chances today. Um, I don't think there'll be loads of chances against Kidderman's next week, but I think they'll have some possession because they'll move the ball around well. Um, but we'll see. You know, we're, we're gonna we're gonna have to play one, well, but we're gonna have to do more going forward. It's, it was a you know it was a bit of a tepid sort of performance from our point of view, and uh, I've, it's my job now to have a look at the film of the game and see what it is that that we need to do to uh, to get that improvement. Thanks, John.